Hi, my amazing planner friends. It's Jess from my magical planner and we have a haul today. So I've been kind of saving most of this up for the month of September to open with you guys, but I know that there are some things in here that I'm going to want for October. So I figured it was time. So we have crafts by Towie. Yes, I did open it because I couldn't wait because these are grab bags and I just flipped through them, but I haven't looked at them in weeks, so I can't remember what's in there. I have two little bees with the cutest cat ever. And then we have some letters to Apollo. I think these are $2 Tuesdays. And then I actually ordered more Happy Planner stickers because I love bringing some of those in. I've recently discovered that they work really well back here for me. And I, I want to continue to do this. So, all right, let's get into this. I'm going to start with the Crafts by Towie. These are grab bags, like I said. I don't think I had anything but grab bags from her. So I have the bow icon slash layering elements one. Um, actually one, two, three of those. I have um, bow icons, layering elements. These are, these are the bigger sheets. And then, oh, there's my thing. I can tell you for sure now. Then we have quarter icons. I think those are these. And let's see. Sorry, I'm looking. <laughs> no, this is supposed to be the quarter and these are the other. And then there's an oops, grab bag, light skin tones, which I think is this. And then a oops, full random kit, which I think is this one. So anyhow, let's start with the kit. Cause I think this is a kit because it could be either one though. Her kits are really, really cute. I like the way that she designs them and I need more Christmas kits and it looks like it even comes with a deco here so we have this really cute I love the frames and everything I think like I don't see anything wrong with this I mean I, it could be cuts because sometimes you can't tell like how good the cuts are but it looks good and I love how close that she comes with her cut lines I don't know if you guys can see that really well but there's just a hair of a outline which makes them really easy to use so also you get this page which oh my gosh look at how cute this is and it matches perfectly the greens which is really really nice so you have these dangle ones and then you also have this one with the floral attached to it already you have like I call these like stamp boxes even though they're not square like the edge always makes me think of a stamp and I love that edge so you have those, but you also get a couple of those as trim so you can pull that element in more. And then you have some of her icons down here, which are amazing. So I love the planner one down here. The house I use all the time. You have a workout one, an apron maybe for marking, you know, your menu or something like that. Or you could use the fork and spoon over here. We have credit card, we have a laptop and a nice cup of coffee and a cocktail. So... I think it's a pretty good variety for your weekly. And then we have the kit, which must be called Noel. So, so pretty. I'm definitely using this this Christmas. This might end up being my Christmas week one. I don't know. But it's gold foil. So, like, the lines on the trees are, it sparkles like a tree. Because these are gold foil baubles right through there. Or lights, maybe. But it looks really pretty. And I love the girl sitting down there with her, I think she has cocoa. I'm not positive, but it looks like she's holding something to drink. And then all the presents and this scene with the chair. So, so comfy and cozy. Love the presents here. The Noel. I have a thing for doors. So I'm loving that we have doors. <laughs> Wrapping presents. December the 25th, which would be like, seriously, this would be perfect for Christmas week. And then you have, you know, setting out your cookies and stuff for Santa. Here at the bottom, these are actually scalloped kind of headers, I think. So yeah, just like that. There's three of them down there. So that's kind of nice. And then we have kind of a functional page here. I'll up to I love all of these at the top. They're so, so pretty. And they have like little dots. Actually, they remind me of a little bit of like the coffee circles, <laughs> but they're so cute. And I love having these unique boxes and 
the way that this one is designed is so, so pretty. So we have some midi boxes through here and some squares, then some fourths. We have fourth size boxes. We have, I think these are third through here and then a line of half boxes, especially like this box down here. Wouldn't this be great for marking Christmas Eve? Just saying. And I love the incorporation of all these little like line dot guys. They're so cute. And the fact that you, she even used it up here, it all coordinates so, so well. The colors are beautiful as well. And then we have this page. This has all your headers over here, your habit trackers down here. You have an additional list over here that you can use for like errands or, you know, maybe you have presents for specific people or something like that. You have some beautiful page flags in different sizes. You have your checklist. Then we have, you know, a couple of scripts that are really, really useful, especially during that time of year. So we have like Amazon. I always have Amazon deliveries, I feel like, the week before Christmas. <laughs> goals, um, work, tidy up, coffee this week and important. And then we have some layering icons. This is really cute. So she has brought this to her shop, I think as a foiled icon. And I, I keep on looking at, it. I want to try it out, but I haven't bought it yet. <laughs> and then we get some additional icons down here, which are different, I think, from the icons we have over here. So it gives you more versatility. So you have the shoe, I think this is nail polish. We have laundry, we have a phone, a grocery bag. I love the popcorn in the chair. I think that's so cute. A different planner. So this looks like this looks like a club planner probably. A spray bottle for like cleaning stuff. You have a different computer here. You have a coffee mug. You have stickers, the happy mail. And then we have a different car. So I think her newer cars look different than either one of these. I think it's closer to this one, but I'm pretty sure you can also find this one in her shop still. And then we have balloons for like birthdays or whatever. And then our final page here has our Monday through Sunday. We have some just really fun deco on the side here to incorporate. And then we have the two different washi strips there. And then on the side, we have more of those scalloped headers. So that would give us, let's see, we had three on the other one and there's four here. So there's seven. So you have a full week's worth, which is actually really nice. So that is my full kit that I'm so excited about for Christmas. All right. And then this one, which I can't remember anything. <laughs> I remember being excited when I peeked at them, but I, other than that, <laughs> And I can tell from the back here that we obviously have some more Christmas stuff. Okay, so this is called Dreamscape. Really pretty boxes. Love the lemons and the blue and everything just goes really well. To, I'm just looking underneath going, oh yeah, she gave me other things for this kit. That's really nice. Okay, so we have the lemons. And then this must be the coordinating, yeah, coordinating sheet for it, which... There were so many lemon kits this last year that it's nice to be able to use it with this, but you didn't have to. And this would be a great addition for another kit if you needed it. Again, I have no idea what the issue is. I, I do see some sparkles kind of through here. So maybe it's just the rubbing off of foil from another kit. I'm not sure. Or another page. Um... This is the November 2021 layering add-on. So it's very similar to the other one I showed you, only this one is foiled in silver. I just, I love her icons. This is the bottom washi and everything that goes to the lemon one here. Really pretty. And I love that we have a little bit of layering gecko over here that perfectly coordinates. It's just a nice touch. I can tell that on this one, some of the foiling isn't perfect. Like, I don't think it would bother me, but it could bother some people. So I understand why she put it aside. Because you have like a little bit here, a little bit on Thursday, maybe a little bit here. And then we have, oh, this is a matching page to this. Oh, that's awesome. And then we have a matching front page. So I could do it both in... In both my flanners, my Hobonichi and my um, 
my bigger planner, my seven by nine, that would actually be kind of fun. I can experiment with this, having an extra sheet. Then we have a floral sheet. This looks perfect for falls. Um, oh, it says fall floral. Okay, yeah, it'll be perfect for fall. <laughs> but I love the colors and these are really big. So for comparison's sake, like when you're looking at it next to a full box, they're, they're decent size. You can cut them down quite a bit to make lots of littler elements if you needed to, but it's nice sometimes to have the big ones. Oh, this is one of my favorite kits that she did. I, I used it last year. I was going to show you, but I think that I'll insert a picture because I just, I love this kit and I actually got it as an oops last year too, <laughs> but it is definitely one of my favorite kits. And I love the washi down here that says grateful, thankful, and it's, oh, the blessed is in there too. It's just a really cute design and I love the simplicity of this one and then we have our Monday through Sunday these boxes are so so cute and then the little deco here amazing and this is the functional page that goes to it so I'm gonna have to look I might have leftovers of the big boxes and if I do I'm I'm gonna have to contemplate whether or not I want to use this again because it is seriously my favorite kit ever for Thanksgiving and then we have some beautiful, these are, I think, fourth size boxes up here. We have third size boxes, half size boxes, the scalloped circles. We have, you know, the squares through here and then these really cool, unique shapes. Yeah, totally love this. And it's foiled in gold. I don't know if I mentioned that. Then we have autumn days. Oh my gosh, look at the books. It has books. I also, I don't know why I like this, but I love when they have the florals coming out of green boots. I, yeah, I don't know. because They definitely do not smell like flowers. I'm telling you, especially if you've had them around a while. Yeah, no, <laughs> but I love the look of it. I love all the orange tones in this. It's so pretty. Then we have this one again. Here's our days of the week. I love the color yellow that she picked for this. It's, it's so, so subtle and like sometimes yellows can be overly bright and this is a nice calm yellow. Then we have more floral down here. Beautiful bottom washi, absolutely gorgeous. I love that she has one that's a busier floral, but it's not overly busy. And then she always has this kind of grounding simple one. Bloom. I don't remember when this one came out. I thought it was so pretty. So we have the full boxes for Bloom. Do I? I know I contemplated getting this one. I have to double check and see if I have one or one that coordinates with it because I have some of her other kits. I love the butterflies. Of course, she makes the most detailed butterflies, like her and Letters to Apollo. So I love that. I love it. We have Flower Shop down here. The quote says, a flower does not think of competing with the flowers next to it. It just blooms. Such a good point. I think we so often get caught up in that. And this again has those scallop boxes at the bottom. Oh, this one says, hello fall. Is that the name of the other kit here? It's autumn days. But their, their colors are close enough. I wonder if they would, well... I'm not sure. The yellow, it's a little bit different. This one's more of a muted or, I don't know. It, this one seems more sunny. Like a lighter yellow than this, but they're close. Anyhow, so again, we have the circle boxes at the top and then her squares. We have, I love these boxes. They're absolutely gorgeous. We have some washi strips in here, which is kind of fun. Third size boxes. Or no, fourth size boxes, third size boxes, and half down here. And we have like the little orange down here. So, so cute. I actually don't know this kit. I'll have to go look on her site so I can see the rest of it because I'm intrigued. And then this is layering icons for November. Love the blue. So pretty. And again, we have her really pretty icons down there. I do have this sheet. I got it last year. 
Did I get two or three of them last year? It actually comes in handy because the white goes with a lot of things and I love the candles. This is really cute. This girl is super cute and the pillows. And I think I have most of the pieces to this kit now too. <laughs> so it's called Home. Oh, I don't think I had this page though. I'll have to look again. <laughs> But again, it's just really pretty. I love these boxes, especially it's foiled in gold and just so pretty. Love the florals down here. And I love that her boxes are so simple, but elegant. And you can so easily add on your own touches to them. It just, it's like a blank slate, but you do have a couple that are, you know, oh, these are the calendaring ones. So I don't know if this is the exact sheet she has in the shop, but I like this. And these are going to be fun for like marking dates or putting the monthly script up there in the corner or something like that. With this really pretty pink and it's rose gold. This one is Bliss Icons. And it's in hollow. I don't have a ton of things I get in hollow. But we have some interesting ones here. So we have, you know, the house. You have a phone with the Wi-Fi thing. I'm thinking maybe bills. We have a water faucet for maybe water bill. So like mortgage, Wi-Fi, internet, water bill, credit cards, car insurance probably, cable, gas stove, and a light bulb for electricity. And then it just repeats like three times. So super cute there. This one I will not be using. <laughs> it says, hello, baby. It's really cute. My babies are just not babies anymore. So maybe I can find somebody to ship this off to. Oh, and I love these of hers. So you can always take these and actually put them together to make the circle, but they work really well as like corners and stuff. And it is just so pretty. It says doily corners and she has a bunch of things in this design and I like them all. Oh, and here is the winter one, which is going to match like they're both gold. We have an ice skate. Yay. If you don't know, I have a daughter who ice skates, so I have to mark ice skating six days a week, <laughs> at least most weeks. And I love these snowflakes that she has. The variety and the detail are really nice. We have a winter sweater, a snow globe. You know, hot beverages here. We have knitting, which I cannot do. And we have a sled and like, you know, the outdoor gear type stuff for being cozy. And then the cutest snowman. Oh my gosh. But uh, yeah, I'm going to leave that with that one. <laughs> so that is everything in like the random oops bag, which is so fun. And then we have this oops bag, which is our bigger layering icons. I don't remember how many are supposed to be in here. But we have laptops, which I use a ton of laptops for editing. And then we have cozy candles. These ones, oh, I think they're for all the different. Okay, so we have leaves over here. We have like anchor and seashell, and then we have roses, and then we have snowflakes over here. Um, I'm trying to read the candle and I'm not sure what it's supposed to be say. <laughs> But anyhow, it's cute. These are good for like self-care nights. Then we have, oh yay, workout icons. So it says fitness. I love her shoes. So she actually has two different ones here. So we have like, oh, and they're going different directions too. So we have Nike and probably Adidas. I'm not sure. And then we have the, oh gosh, I can't remember the names of these right now. But the, yeah, yeah, you know the weight thingies. And then we have different weights down here. <laughs> Obviously I work out all the time. <laughs> and these are her unfoiled icons, by the way. So these are just black and white. This is one of my favorite ones that she does, the desk. I think it's really awesome. And then I love the closet for, you know, switching seasons. So you can go through and figure out what you need. We have a pot and pan there. We have Chinese food, love ordering Chinese food doesn't love me, but I love it. <laughs> we have her organization boxes. We have the apron. We have some planner stuff there. Cute little slippers, stickers. Okay, probably won't use the wedding cake. 
Love this girl with the shampoo. I don't know that I've seen that one before. The glasses. Maybe it's on one of the sheets that I haven't looked at too closely, but that's really cute. Then we have nice pens for doing, you know, marking stuff in your planner, like your planner time. That's what I'm trying to say. And then these are balloons. And because they're not foiled, I don't have to, to worry about what foil I'm using. So these are going to be really versatile for me. Okay, so there is the bigger oops. And then we have some smaller bags. So I promised my son I would take him to the bank. So I need to do that and I'll be back to finish this. All right, now on to the smaller oops bags. I totally love her icons, they're so cute. So we have golden pajamas. Or no, these are shorts outfits with sneakers, sorry. I thought they were pajamas at first. You know, I'm going to zoom in. That'll be a little easier on you guys. Ooh, we have roses. Also very pretty. I don't know that I've seen her roses before. Playing cards. Good for game nights. Different shapes. This will be fun to incorporate. So it's scallop frame layering. Okay. Flip flops. Great for summer. Yeah, scales. These are really cute. Gas. And it looks like the, I think I did each color in the foil. So I think these are all gold. And then the other bags, I have a silver and a rose gold. So more ovals. Stickers. Or it says Happy Meal, which I think is really awesome. These would be great for like my Simply Gilded box and then Sadie stickers and Simply or and Sticker Guru. Everybody needs more nail polish icons. So cute. Cruise ships. I've been on like one cruise ever. <laughs> I was just talking about cruises with my sisters. We were thinking about going on I have three older sisters that the four of us will go on a cruise together. Yeah, not sure yet. These are headers. Um, boot. Oh, Louis Vuitton headers. Okay. Oh, I like these for Easter. Really cute eggs. I remember when she released these. They were so cute. Airplanes. Side view. Oh, this is a limited edition one. I guess she only had it for a while. Oh, the microphones. It's called podcast. I use, use these for my voiceovers. Feeding. Probably won't use this one. <laughs> Although I guess I could cut it. So I just have the alarm clock. I would probably use that. Target bags. I don't go to Target that often either anymore. These are like gym bags or it says duffel bags. Again, it says limited edition. We have strollers. I should put together all of the baby stuff I got and find somebody to send it to. Burgers and fries. Actually, I could use that to mark Dan's work because he works at a burger joint. Dan is my son. And then we have planner spreads. This is cute too. I don't, do I have this one? I don't think I have this one, but I really like it. Okay, so that's everything in the gold. Let's go rose gold next. Maybe. Possibly. Okay. So I really love the cameras. I'm trying to think. I put in an order this last week because she had a sale. And I don't remember if I got the rose gold. Or well, the cameras. I might have because I really think they're cute. And I think they'd be great for Instagram. We have rain boots. I kind of have a thing for rain boots, guys. I think they're so cute. Flowers and mason jars. Cute. Organized desk. I do that like every week. <laughs> oh, I like the fireplace. Um, it says miscellaneous sheet. So we have 
like a court gavel. I there are some channels that I follow that are like um, legal commentary, and I could mark those with that. We have cross stitch, which I don't really have time for. I more do embroidery these days. We have a sun behind the clouds. We have like clean or sanitary, you know, like the Clorox wipes. Um, praying, maybe church, the stroller, uh, wedding anniversary, I want to say, like with the two rings or something, I can mark that. The fireplace, it just makes me think of like fall, the cute moon over here. We have press on nails, probably wouldn't use that one. We have knitting, probably wouldn't use that one. <laughs> I tried knitting once, it, it didn't go well. <laughs> we have presents and then the paint can, of course. So I really like the variety on here. You know, I wouldn't use all of them, but most of them. I love these cups. They're so cute. And then this is the food sampler. So I don't really mark my food and maybe I should like, maybe that would help me track it because I'm having a hard time tracking it. And then we have silhouette machines. I don't have one. <laughs> That goes in my pile and I need to find a new home for it. And then we have presents or gift boxes. Those would be great for birthday parties. And wrapping paper. Oh, these are really, really cool. I like these planes. So it's an airplane going around the world. So cool. She should bring those back. Said limited edition. We have whiskey. I don't know that I'm going to use that, or at least not to mark whiskey. Um, yeah, not my thing. But what are these? It says seltzer on them. Seltzer drinks. I don't know that I'll use those either. We have little playgrounds. Maybe I'll use these. I'm not sure. These are her cars that I love because I've always wanted a Volkswagen bug. Although lately I've been going, PT cruisers are pretty cool too. <laughs> Cleaning stuff. I love her little washing machine for some reason. And this one with the little bubbles. I mean, like just the detail is really nice. We have more nail polish. Which, did the other one have the cap on? I wanna see it did. Where was that? Was that gold? Hold please as I find the nail polish one, because I want to see. Oh no, it had it. It was the same. Okay. All right, my camera died, so I don't know if you guys got all of the what I said about the nail polish, but I was just comparing it to the gold. For some reason, I thought the cap was still on <laughs> in the gold, but no, it's the same. Then we have dog things. I probably won't use any of this either. I don't have a dog, but that's okay. I think it's still really cute. We have the scalloped ovals. And then, oh, this is like her fitness sampler, which I actually just looked at. Kettlebell, that's what that's called. <laughs> Sheesh. <laughs> but I think this is kind of fun. I, I definitely can use the football sampler or the football guy because we have homecoming this coming week. I like the bike, it looks really cute. The workout clothes, I, I feel the necessity of the scale. I don't like the scale. <laughs> and then the elliptical and the sports, like the sh shaker ball drinks. And I think it's a really good variety. Oh, sorry guys. Then we have the organized desk again and more mason jar fl flowers, more rain boots, and, oh, is this the, did I get through all of these in the right direction? Do we just have repeats or <laughs> did I do something wrong here? <laughs> I don't know, I might have. I don't know guys, but anyhow, that is the <laughs> rose gold. And then we have silver. Which I can already tell the top one here is just, it's fun. It's called Travel. And again, it has this really cool icon with the plane going around the world. And then you also have like the view out of the window of the plane, which I think is amazing. We have card games, palm trees, the cruise ship, 
soft serve ice cream, your passport, another plane, luggage, the camera, another plane, um, a larger car, the like your here spot <laughs> by Google Maps. That's what this makes you think of. And then we have a duffel bag and one last plane. So it's definitely a difference from this plane to that plane. So I don't know which one. I, I really love this plane. <laughs> I want that plane. Okay, now we have kayaks, which every once in a while we go kayaking. So I can always use that one. And this is their leisure sampler is what it's called. So we have, let's see here, we have a church. I don't think of churches as leisure. <laughs> Am I wrong? <laughs> we have TV, we have camping. Oh, I like the audiobook, which is what I assume this is with the headphones and the book. That is really nice. I, I could definitely use more of those. Then we have the decorative pillows, I think, there and a book, which is really cute. We have the, the Target game bag. We have a gaming controller. We have dice and cards, which makes me think of Vegas. <laughs> we have, you know, an iPhone here. We have luggage. We have, I think this is essential oils here. The puppy paws. And then we have stuff for painting, which is really cute. We have fireplaces. Great for fall. We have lingerie. Ooh, a little spicy. Um, we have more of the house cleaning ones. We have UV nail lights, so like gel polish. Okay. Nail stuff. We have the phone with hearts. I love the hearts. We have tacos. We always have Taco Tuesday. <laughs> so this is awesome. And then let's see. Ooh, popcorn for movies. And I like that some of them have bows, but some of them don't. And I kind of like having the option. We have blood samples. We do a lot of blood tests around here, so that could be very useful. More of the fitness sampler. I think it was rose gold that I had one. I am so happy we have a football. And then we have the elongated cars. We have more of the podcast microphones and they have little hearts. I don't remember if the other one had little hearts or not. And it looks like there's an icon missing. Maybe that's why it's an oops. I don't know. And then we have Lemonade, which was limited edition. Stethoscopes. Stethoscopes. I can always use more stethoscopes. Oh, reading. That's what she calls this one with the like little throw pillows and the book there. We have our mini utensils. We have weights. And this one is the health sampler. Oh, I like this. So I can use most of these. So we have like healthy drinks. So probably smoothies. The doctor one, we have a prescription. We have salad. We have a pregnancy test. Probably won't use that one. <laughs> we have the dentist. We have, I think this is floss, so that's dentist as well. We have the coffee cup. Maybe that's like either not feeling well and like you have hot tea or like therapy maybe. And then we have the therapist lounger. And then we have tea and tissues, colds. This I'm assuming is going to mark periods. And that would be, you know, your contact lenses. That's what they're called. <laughs> but anyhow, that's everything I have from Crafts by Towie. I am so grateful when I get her oops bags or anyone's oops bags. I think they're an amazing deal and so fun. Because it's like a mystery every time. <laughs> All right, I'm going to zoom back out. There we go. <laughs> and set these to the side. And let's do the two little bees. This was a really fun kit that they came out with. And as soon as it came out, I was like, oh, I need that one. So let's see here. And I actually had forgotten that I ordered it, to be honest. 
And I was looking at fall kits yesterday and I was like, oh, I should order a fall kit. No, I really don't need to. <laughs> I have so many fall kits, but I love them all. <laughs> can we just extend fall for like another month so I can use at least that many kits? Because Halloween and fall are kind of battling <laughs> right now in my planner space. <laughs> so anyhow, they have this cute little doily. This is the deco that goes to this particular kit, which is called Autumn Breeze. And we have very beautiful monarch butterflies and all of these cute florals to pick from as well. And then here is Autumn Breeze. Oh, it's just my receipt. I adore this scene right here. It just, I want my backyard to look like that. <laughs> So if someone can come and make my backyard look like that, that'd be great. <laughs> and then we have like kind of the falling leaves and just coziness. I love this scene as well. Would love that to be my living room. <laughs> Doesn't quite look like that. I like the Hello Autumn. I have to look and see when the first week of fall is and if I've missed it. Because I kind of want to do this, but then there's the Halloween kits. Yeah, it's a thing. And then we have fresh brewed pumpkin spice lattes served daily with all of, I think these are Starbucks things or like faux Starbucks things. Cause they don't have like the Starbucks icon. They have like a leaf, but they look like Starbucks. <laughs> and then this, like I have a couple of like $2 Tuesday type decos that would match this perfectly. And so I'm super excited about that. And I love the outfit. I think it's funny that there are leaves coming out of the pans, <laughs> but I actually really like it. And then we have a Kate Spade. Does she have a planner? Is there a Kate Spade planner? I don't know, but that's what it says. And then we have fall bucket list. It says drink pumpkin spice, um, light fall candles, go apple picking, visit a pumpkin patch, bake apple pie, snuggle by fire. Yeah, that would be my to-do list. <laughs> And then down here at the bottom, this is a strip here that you can use kind of as a washi strip. So you have all of these full boxes and then this. On the following page, oh, look at these page flags. They're so pretty. I love this. Well, I guess I should put it this way so you can see it a little better. But I love that one with the fireplace. And these are just gorgeous. You get a little bit of deco in the corner so she's not wasting space. You have all of your headers through here, your Monday through Sunday with this leaf. Oh my goodness. Just wow. You have all of your checklist. You have your habit trackers and look at this box. Look at how pretty that is. Just, just saying. I love that in the deco we have an umbrella because at least here fall means cold and rainy <laughs> and I'm not upset about it. You know, I kind of like fall cold and rainy days where you snuggle up with a book. So the fact that she has an umbrella is just, yeah, it just makes me smile. And then we have pumpkin spice in the candle. We have another butterfly, the sign, some cozy drinks. And this is a knit pumpkin, pumpkin. This is a knit pumpkin. I don't know if that comes across or not, but you have the knit details on it and it's so cute. And I love these boxes as well. Then we have more functional boxes. And look, 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 the umbrellas on the functional boxes. And I love that this one has the planner. And the way she did this one is so cute as well. I love that we have some, you know, blank slate boxes as well. And it just, it's a good variety. You have a couple of icons up here. I'm really digging the, the clipboards lately. I like to mark school stuff on them. And then the torn paper element. So you don't have to get the journaling kit to get the torn paper. I kind of like that. She switches up her kits, I think, constantly to really follow the trends and what people are liking, which is something I, I really admire about her shop because that's not easy to do. And then here is our next page. Look at that. That is absolutely stunning for a full box. And I love this box down here. It's just pretty. And we have our Monday through Sunday and this week. And these are contour cut or kiss cut, however you want to deal with it. And around 
the um, the swatch there. And then for our washi, so we have like a more traditional washi here. And then the one above it, check this out. It's, it's cut, like I love this concept of it being cut around the florals. I just think that's so pretty. So that is that page. And then this is her extra, no, it goes that way. I was looking at the bottom going, I have that upside down, but I think they just did it that way for spacing. But anyhow, um, I love this page. I don't know if it's considered the journaling page or just extra boxes page, but either way, I find it really helpful. I love the Polaroids and these are smaller than the Polaroids I currently have, which is kind of, I'm going to play around with the different sizes and see what I like better, but I think that's really fun. I love having more deco up here. These boxes are really nice for layering or putting icons on these ones as well. And you just have more variety when you get this extra page. And then our final page is this one. So I have more of the like washi like this, only this one doesn't have the butterflies or the bows that are foiled in there. Oh, and I should mention this is all foiled in rose gold. So that's everything that I got from Two Little Bees. I think it's the cutest kit, seriously. Okay, now let's do $2 Tuesdays. These are both from Letters to Apollo, so I'm going to open both of them. And we'll just set them here and we'll go through them at the same time. So this is one order. <laughs> Which, when she came out with these, I was like, oh, I need more florals. <laughs> because, yeah, I need more florals. <laughs> And what was this one? I can't remember. Oh yeah, that's spiders. Yes. Okay, let's do fall colors first. Because these are the ones that I was like offhand thinking of for this next one. Man, I may have to use, um, I still gotta decide if I'm doing Halloween all month or if I'm doing Halloween and fall or, yeah. It's hard guys, it's really, really hard. All right, I'm gonna do trims first so I can set them off to the side. So this one is called Sweater Weather. <laughs> Have you guys heard the Instagram sound with the sweater weather? It cracks me up. So I had to do one. Sticker Guru has a kit that's called Sweater Weather. So I did one with that. But I love these colors, kind of the muted pinks. So pretty. And then these are kind of matching. They're, so I think that was the only trim that I got with, oh no, I have one more florals, but these are the, like the, the lacy edge type ones and I wanted to play around with them. So they're in, on the transparent Mac and pink and black on this one. And that's sultry is what it says. And then this is sultry's florals. It's more of that black and deeper pinks and it looks really stunning together. And I think I have a kit or two that has this, but I was also considering using it on my dashboard page. Then we have this one with pumpkin spice, which is just perfect. I wonder if pumpkin spice, no, no, no. I have enough florals with that. I was like, will it match that last kit? It might, but. And then of course, this is the, it's called crispy leaves. So cute. And this is just a fun pattern. And it has like little florals in here. Super cute. If she did that and put like little leaves in there, I think that would be really fun too. Maybe I'll send her that as a suggestion. You yeah, know, they don't have to do it. Sometimes it's just fun to suggest things. So this is sweater weather again with the bigger florals. Sweater weather, excuse me. Sweater weather with smaller florals, which are super cute. Okay, we're gonna zoom in again. That way I don't have to lift things up so far. <laughs> so there it is in the smaller, and this is the difference in coloring, which sometimes, like it amazes me what the difference can be sometimes. And this is the headers for sweater weather as well. And then sultry's boxes. These are so fun. And Sultry's headers, Sultry's florals. Look at how stunning these are. I mean, seriously. Yeah, 
just wow. And sultry smaller ones. I think it looks more stunning on the transparent mat, to be honest. And the toppers. And then spiced pumpkin. Oh, look at these. Oh my gosh, they look so pretty. I can't wait to use those in my Hobonichi as like journaling pages. Yeah, it's going to look awesome. Here's Spice Pumpkin. Now look at the difference here in the coloring. These definitely have a lot more peachy to them. I don't know if it, like, if she changes it or not, but there's definitely a sizable difference in the color. And then here's Pumpkin Spice on the transparent mat. Here's Pumpkin Spice boxes and the headers. I wonder if, <laughs> so, so much of this is like buried. I wonder if I was paying attention to what it was when I was putting them in the cart. I don't think I was. <laughs> I think that's why I'm all over the board here. <laughs> all right, and then this is the spiderweb one. So it's like a Halloween one. I wonder, I'm trying to remember what I bought. That's what's going on right now. And I can't remember. <laughs> Sometimes I just, you know, black out all that stuff. But here are the trims. Look at how amazing that is. So you have one trim here and it's going around those spiders and everything. So hold on, let me show you. Look at that. The detail is amazing. Yeah, in love, totally in love with this one. And then the way she did this one, the dainty web flourishes with the little web here, I thought was so pretty. And I got these in black because um, I didn't feel like I needed to have a foil on them. And by not putting a foil on them, I could use them with any kit. So I did get these ones in silver because I know I have some silver kits. And I like the way the flourish kind of looks. You know how the air kind of swirls and something fast goes through it? That's what it makes me think of. So I got those in silver, rose gold, and gold, because I really liked them. Then I got these ghosts, <laughs> which are hilarious. Oh, I love them. I want to draw Mickey ears on them, though. <laughs> then we have Halloween movies, which I got in black as well, which we have Hocus Pocus. Hocus Pocus 2 is coming out really soon. I can't wait. Ghostbusters. Um, Night Before Christmas. I think she had a scary movie one and like a not so scary movie one. <laughs> and I got the um, not so scary one because those are the movies that I watch, like the cheesy ones, like Haunted Mansion. Can we just talk about cheese there? <laughs> and Casper, um, the Adams Family. Like these are my movies. <laughs> and then we have Little Ghosts with Little Spiders. I mean, they're just cute. And, oh, did I get these in different foils too? I did. I got that in all three foils too. <laughs> and then look at these little ghosts. I mean, seriously, they're the best. They're the pizza one. I just love it. Watering the flowers. <laughs> Ice cream ghost, taking a picture ghost. I mean, seriously, I'm in love. <laughs> so I got that. Oh, I did get it in all three foils. And then I got, and this must be the larger flourishes. Let me see. Hold on. So this is, yeah, this one right here <laughs> is the large flourish. And there's the small one next to it to kind of give you an idea. So this would span the whole width of a column. And this would be only partial, kind of like a midi box. Okay. The one thing I regret not getting she had some cats dressed as ghosts, and I should have gotten them. I should have, but I didn't. They were so cute, though. All right, the last thing I have actually is a Happy Planner order from their new release. I just couldn't resist them. I mean, seriously, they were so cute. I'm going to end with the Disney one. Let's look at this one first. This is called Fall Harvest, and... I sometimes it says like what size it is, but because it doesn't say, I'm going to say it's like the traditional size, like classic or whatever. 
So look at how pretty these are. I mean, just stunning. And of course, sweater weather is here too. <laughs> yeah, and this is in rose gold. We have more quotes through here, some really nice boxes that you can pull in. And these ones are really cute as well. Happy Halloween, rainy day. It has some winter scenes, some Thanksgiving scenes, more boxes. And the Hello Weekend, that kind of thing. Snuggle up. Oh, it says keep warm and snuggle up. These are, work great. So in my Hobonichi, I've been using them a little different. Let me show you. I like literally, I don't know why it took me so long to figure this out. When I did, I was like, are you kidding me? <laughs> so here we go. So you can use those bigger boxes to cover up the Japanese print at the bottom and it looks perfect. And like, I don't know, it just looked really cool. And so I think I want to use the happy planner stickers back here because I like this. I've struggled with how to decorate back here because I don't know what's me, but this is me. Okay. So, which is part of the reason I got this book. Plus, it was a fall book, guys. I couldn't resist it. So, this is more like wintry with the fox here. All of these ones. I like that we have lines on some of these for journaling pages. We have the swatches. This would be really cool if it was on transparent. And then trees. And then rain boots i know i i don't understand my thing for rain boots but i think they're adorable today's plan now these boxes are stunning so it comes with the florals underneath which i just thought was so cool so and these are unfoiled so they can go with any foil that you may have in a kit but these ones here are just so pretty and then we get to the foiled ones and i was like Yes, please. Because <laughs> they're so pretty. They are bigger than what I normally use from like um, a weekly perspective with the kids. But I can incorporate them if I want to. And then we have these smaller washi strips. We have importance. Don't forget. Today. Priority plans. Get it done. And I like the print that they used. Again, I think I would like it even more if it was on transparent. But I can deal. And then you have these, and I'm guessing these are sized so you can put things in them. Like you could put this at the top and then have your priority of three. We have some more boxes. We have some really cute Halloween stuff. <laughs> I like this one with the pumpkin. And I like spooky season. And this is Thanksgiving. And then I'm thankful for shopping list, prepare. So still going with Thanksgiving here. These are untransparent and I like the font that they use. So I have a bunch of todays. We have remember, we have important. At first I thought it said unimportant, but it says important. Um, celebrate, priority, and weekend plans. So those are really nice. This is another one on the transparent mat. These are just florals more florals, more florals. And this one in the middle, that's a box. Oh wait, no, it's not. I thought it was a box, but it's a, you know, top and bottom one. Really cute. These will go with some of those new florals I got from Letter to Apollo, I think. And then we have the foxes and stuff. I guess I didn't see that they did some of these on transparent too. These are also transparent some headers and layering things. We get all of the gear down here, including at the very bottom, an umbrella. <laughs> More these ones with words like cuddle up. I love the bunny slippers, love. And we have fox ones too, so cute. We have sweater weathers, warm wishes, the mittens, the cute boots. And more quotes with cute little florals all in the rose gold. And same here. All right. And last but certainly not least is the new 
Disney ones they came out with, which again, it's so it's Mickey and Minnie seasonal. And I think this is just the normal size. So we have, you know, Christmas ones. This is Valentine's Day, Lucky Me, so St. Patrick's Day, Bloom, Life is Wonderful, Love These Moments, and then you have all the flags on the side. And then we have more kind of wintry themed ones here. More kind of spring up in this area and another skating one. I love the skating one. Then we have these ones here still coordinating. But look, you have the red truck with Mickey. I love, 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 love this. Be bright. I love the joy of here. Like Mickey and Christmas, it's kind of like my two favorite things are coming together. <laughs> then you have all of these Mickey heads. I could actually see using some of these, like if you white it this out or put something over it, then using this as like a two from on a gift. And then we have spread joy and just a couple of others, some really cute checklists, which actually with the Maihoanichi, I've been using just as decorative edges. And then we have some transparent Mickeys, love the gold ones, but they're all really cute. I like this one, start each day with a grateful heart with many and fun day, busy day, big day, that kind of thing. And then we have some corner stickers and that kind of thing. This is a huge sticker. <laughs> I mean, it's like palm size, but I think it's really stunning. I like this one as well. I don't know that I would use these on anything but a journaling page though, for me, because they would be too large otherwise. Maybe a dashboard, maybe. I like this. <laughs> I think it's funny when you sticks out this tongue. I don't know why. More of the red truck more fun day and notes and that kind of thing. I don't know if I'll use that page, to be honest. Um, don't forget, um, we have some more on transparent here. I really like this one. Same here, more of these. Yeah, I don't know that these are, these are me, but we'll try them. And then more here, stay kind. I love this one so much. And this one is really cute as well. Look at the boo. Look at it. So, so cute. And we have transparent with the spider web on it, which is adorable. We have this one. Start each day with a grateful heart. And I just love the way it looks. I mean, seriously. We have some bigger florals through here. And then these two. Seize the day. Today is yours, so like birthday. Think big, start small. These Mickey hats are probably my favorite ones that they did. And then these colors, and that's it. So that's everything I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this. I can't wait to start planning with all of this and get into October. It'll be so fun. If you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button over there. Until next time. I'll see you real soon.